What's good? Big motherfucking Jake dog. Yo. Attention. You know what I mean? Yo. This is You Might Be Ghetto With Part 1. This is going to be, you know what I'm saying? This is going to be the, the what's, what's the word I'm looking for? This is going to be the prototype in which all others are based. You know what I mean? So I dress up a little bit for you. For your motherfucking ass, that's how we get down. Because I had to change the look, you know what I'm saying? Tired of looking hood all the time, you know, I'm, I'm gang shot, yelling at you motherfuckers all the time, y'all niggas take it, so figure out soften up a little bit. You bitch ass niggas, cause you bad niggas come out of here, nigga, you know what I mean? But anyway, yo, let's get ready, motherfucking into it, dog, for reals. Yo! Alright, you might be motherfucking ghetto if you live in a motherfucking apartment, right? And then everything in your motherfucking apartment with your apartment is motherfucking rented. Hey, yo, dog, you might be ghetto if, um, you got a motherfucking projection screen TV, you know what I mean? Yo, and you got roaches, you know, crawling across the screen. Doing commercial breaks, what the fuck, you know what I'm saying? Hey, yo, you might be ghetto if you go to the motherfucking club with your motherfucking girlfriends and shit, and then between all three of you motherfuckers, you got one, you, you got one motherfucking outfit. Between all three of y'all, you wearing your girl's shit, your girl's wearing some of yours, you wearing your other girl's shit, what the fuck is going on? You might be ghetto if you go to the motherfucking store, dog, buy some motherfucking new threads and shit, and then you keep the motherfucking receipt on the motherfucking shit so you can go back to return shit on motherfucking Monday. I understand, you know, niggas live a hood, hey. You gotta do what your motherfucker do, dog. I fucking tell you. Dog, you might um, be ghetto if you have to pawn your motherfucking gold teeth to get car. To get gas in your motherfucking car with 20 inch rims. You might be ghetto. You might be motherfucking ghetto if you ever went to a rental rim shop. Okay? You might be ghetto if you ever. If you ever opened up a replica. Rent a rim shop. What the fuck? A replica? Rent a rim shop? Come on, nigga. Get your motherfucking shit right, dog. You know what I'm saying? Yo. You uh, you might be ghetto if you're going around, you know, supporting uh, fake ass Rolex watches. Talk about Bolex, Bolex. What the fuck is a Bolex? Like, I never heard of motherfucking Bolex and shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know, I mean, I mean Dolce and Gibanas. What the fuck? I mean, yo, niggas, whatever, dog. Yo, you might be motherfucking ghetto if you got some Tims. You know what I'm saying? Niggas say Tims. Yo, I put this motherfucking nigga front. You feel me? Yo, matter of fact, nigga was my cousin, and I'm sorry to say this shit, but a nigga, you know, shit got to be put down. You know what I mean? All right, I got to see some money guys in boots. I'm like, yo, these niggas are tight. She's tight. I'm like, yo, we got a boot today. He's like, yo, they Tim's. I'm like, what? Them Timberlands, nigga? Nigga showing up. Nigga looking on the motherfucking side of the boot. Say T-I-M-S, Tim's. I'm like, yo, niggas stop riding the hoe. What the fuck? I know you niggas out there laughing. Don't be laughing because I know you niggas don't know niggas like that. You know what I'm saying? You might be ghetto if you've ever gotten stabbed or killed for a $2 crack debt, nigga. You might be motherfucking ghetto. You know what I'm saying? Um... Let me see here. You might, uh, oh, yeah. You might be ghetto if you got more motherfucking macaroni and cheese and oodles and noodles in your motherfucking cupboard than you got motherfucking utensils in your drawers, nigga. You might be motherfucking ghetto. You know what I mean? That's how we motherfucking get down. Um, let me see. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I got a question for you, motherfuckers, real quick. You know what I'm saying? Hey, why did it? All right. This is what I want to motherfucking know. You know what I mean? Y'all niggas need to pay attention to what's going on in the motherfucking world, dog, for real. The humanization of food products. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Yo, come on, dog. You got a carrot, right? You got a carrot. And you got a baby carrot. Nigga, two carrots don't get together and fucking make a baby carrot, nigga. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? You have uh, baby celery, baby onions. Nah, nigga, these niggas don't reproduce. Sorry. They're grown. You know what I mean? Yo. Um, uh, you might be good if you got posters in your house of cars you're never going to ride in or... Or you're never going to be able to afford. You might be ghetto if you name your kids after cars that you will never be able to ride in or afford. Mercedes, Porsche, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, them ghetto motherfucking names. You might be ghetto if you got solid letters in your name and it, you don't even need the letters in your name. Yeah, my name is Rayvon with a Z, but the Z is solid. Fuck all that. You know what I mean? Real. Um, let me see. Uh... You might be ghetto. Oh, yeah. You might be motherfucking ghetto if you live, if you're 35 years old living in your motherfucking mother basement. You know what I'm saying? You might be ghetto if you put your own fucking name on shit in the refrigerator. You might be motherfucking ghetto. You know what I'm saying? You might be motherfucking ghetto if you want a, 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 a grill so bad that you go to the motherfucking kitchen and go get some aluminum foil and make yourself a grill because you want to be ice grilling. You know what I mean? Rails. So you motherfucking get down, dog. Attention. You know, you might be motherfucking ghetto. You know what I mean? You might be ghetto if you add shit on your car that don't have performance. You know what I mean? You might be ghetto if you put fake badges on your car. Motherfuckers talking about they got a Cobra, they got a regular GT. Or they got dual exhaust, they got a V6. What the fuck? You know what I mean? Yo. Um. Yeah. So, yo. 
attention, um, you know what I'm saying, attention, you might be dealing with level one, and the prescription, subliminally, is a subscription to the channel, stay tuned to your boy Big Zig, you might be getting number one, holla at your boy niggas, and bitches, one.